Wow. ABC News senior medical contributor Dr. Jennifer Ashton joins us now and I'm sure a lot of the rest full resuscitation very very is fetal property in terms of our immune system somehow gets exposed that's the first blow almost like an anaphylactic reaction followed by uncontrollable to clot and uh, fatality rate is huge about one in two moms who have term neurological Is there any problems. warning that it could be coming? You know, she talked about this um, this time in general in medicine, but also what can you do if somebody right. comes to you with a sense of foreboding? Well, it goes smoothly. When things go wrong, they tend to go wrong in a big way, and you have two lives at your a lot of female pregnant and and, right. and healthily so. Is there anything they can look for? Not really. I mean, this is why we say most of the time women, yes, they can give birth at home and everything will, will be fine. But when something goes wrong, you need full anesthesia staff, blood bank, ability to do a full resuscitation. And that can only take place in the hospital. So as much as we don't like a lot of monitoring, that, that type of monitoring saved this woman's life. All right. Again, it's called amniotic fluid embolism. embolism. Yeah. Really a remarkable story. A so true sad. miracle Both that she survived. Both yeah. okay. Absolutely. Thank you, Dr. Ashton. You and coming up on Good Morning America, we're one on